New Jersey flooding leaving a mess in Lodi. It's becoming more more of a problem that we keep getting flooded. Right now, I don't have heat. I don't have hot, hot water. Biani Garcia is pumping water from the basement of her mother's home for the second time in three weeks. Whenever we get hit, we only get hit once, and then we get a break a couple of years. Yeah. Well, yeah. <laughs> and this is the first time it's just happened one right after the other. Just feet away from Garcia's home, emergency crews worked to remove a runaway shipping container from the Saddle River, which crested Wednesday afternoon. County officials say the container came loose from the nearby Boys and Girls Club and became lodged at an overpass. Viani and her mother Ambrosia spoke directly with yeah, Governor yeah. Murphy after they say they didn't get help or answers anywhere else. We don't have any magic wands, but we're <laughs> going to do what we can. The governor's office says residents who need immediate help should contact their local office of emergency sure. management for shelter options. Call your insurance company if you have flood coverage and document and report all damage to your town. We also asked Governor Murphy why he declared a state of emergency for this storm and not the December flooding. I think it came in as predicted a bigger event. But more importantly, it was a cumulative event. It's unfortunately we're seeing exactly what we had expected come true. Uh, and we're going to be obviously assessing how we deal with Friday into Saturday and then again next Tuesday.